and we're back. This will be our final video of Bakugan Q&A video. So let's begin. This question is from Drake Flame the Dragonoid Man, and he's got 12 questions for us. Question 82. What is your favorite Bakugan character? J-Rex has three favorite Bakugan. Me, Trox, and Picatrix. Yes, we all know you guys are J-Rex's most favorites. I do know J-Rex likes the main Bakugan like us. As for Drake, his number one favorite Bakugan is Dragonoid. That's why his name is Drake Flame the Dragonoid Man. Well, if I'm Drake's number one favorite Bakugan, then I agree. In your faces, Nilius, I'm Drake's number one favorite. Quit being such a show-off, Drago. Are you jealous because you're not Drake's number one favorite? Anyway, for the viewers, comment down below who are your favorite Bakugan or Geogon. Question 83. What is your favorite small story part? Ugh, there's too many to count. I might as well show you this list. Question 84. What is your favorite episode of the series? Ugh, oh, there's too many to count, but J-Rex loves all of episodes of Bakugan. Well, some of them actually. Question 85. Which character from the original series do you think it should make their return? Ah, so hard to choose, but I will show you which characters from the original series. Question 86. In the Backyard Tournament Games, which attribute were you voting for? Well, since Jarek's not here to answer this question, I guess we'll never know what he votes for. Question 87. To Drago, which rival and villain is more challenging for you? Well, for rival, it's definitely Nilius. Nilius is my greatest rival because we battle each other a lot. As for villains, it's either Sabris or Villoc. Question 88. To Drago, what do you think when there's a Monster Truck version of you in Monster Jam and Funko Pop version of you? For Monster Jam, I look really cool as a Monster Truck version. As for the Funko Pop version, it looks impressive, but my head is a bit big. But I wonder why they make their head so big for the Funko Pop. They also made me as a Funko Pop version, including a Jeet. Do you guys think we're going to be a Monster Truck version and a Funko Pop version? Highly unlikely, Patrix. Question 89. To Cyrus, which Bakugan do you feel that you want to go out on a date with? Oh dear, do I have to pick and go on a date? I know many of you want me to pick one of the male Bakugans. But some of you might think I'm not being honest for that pick. See, she gets it. Don't worry, Cyrus. I'll choose for you. Drago! You don't get to make a decision for Rascal. I was only trying to help. I think I'd rather not answer this one. Question 90. To Leonidas, do you hope to show up in the series or hope to be in the second Bakugan video game? I say I hope to be in the Bakugan series, if only I get a chance to be in it. Question 91. To all Bakugan, what product that Spin Masters should make to support this series like any merchandise, decorations, toys, or any cool stuff? Well, depending on those cool stuff for the Spin Master, Perhaps some clothes, shoes, hats, and bags that has pictures of Bakugan. Or action figure Bakugan toys for little kids to play. Maybe some Bakugan coloring books and stories. Or Bakugan card games to play Snap, Memories, and Goldfish. Let's not forget about Bakugan parties like balloons, pinatas, and cakes. Or perhaps some Bakugan plush toys for the little kids to play and sleep. That would be nice for the little kids. A plush toy? Uh, like this? Something like that, Gorthion. We have other ideas, but let's move along. Question 92. To Drago and Cyndius, how do you guys feel when you guys won the Backyard Tournament? It feels awesome that we won in the Backyard Tournament. We became champions of Backyard Tournament. And I'm very proud of both of you. But next time, we won't lose to you. And someday, we will beat you and we will become the champions of the Backyard Tournament. I'd like to see you try, Nilius. Anyways, question 93. For Drago and the Geogon group, have you guys been doing training ever since you're going to be doing a tournament for the sake of the bond between Vestroya and Earth? Why yes, we've been training a lot along with our partners. And this is for the sake of the bond between Vestroya and Earth. 
and we're not going to let Vela to separate Vestroia from Earth. Agreed. Even though Vestroia is our home, Earth is our home too. At least the Geogon can be able to help us if we're in trouble. So let's move on to the next question. This question is from Bennington Support Group, and he's got two questions for me. Question 94. Drago, what do you do when you're not in the battle against other Bakugan? I like to enjoy and relax myself while I'm reading the book. Question 95. Drago, why do you have a name called Maximus? Because Maximus is my true name before I rename myself as Dragonoid. But when I used my Maximus armor, I became Dragonoid Maximus. Question 96. Seneca, how's it like to be with Leah? Well, Leah is alright, even though we don't get along with each other a lot. At least you've learned your lesson that you need help from Leah. Yeah, whatever, Trox. This question is from Wolfstar Convoy, and he's got two questions. Question 97. For all Bakugan, what do you all think of the original Bakugan and Brawlers, especially original Dan and Drago? It's very interesting of that show, but it kind of reminds me of the Yo-Gi-Oh when they use their cards in the battle. But for us, we don't use ability cards. We use our own special powers in the Bakugan battle. Yeah, that's true. As for Dan and Drago, they look different than I expected. The rest of the Bakugan and Brawlers are quite interesting. As for Shun, he looks different in the original series, and he's partnering with the Ventus Bakugan. As for Hydronoid, it only has one head. And as for Alpha Hydronoid, it has three heads and wings. Why can't I have wings? That show's not bad, but let's move on. Question 98. To everyone, what is your favorite snack to eat? Well, not sure, but we like any types of snacks that we like to eat. But for me, I love eating bananas and potato chips. Question 99. Drago, how much do you and your friends love fighting together as a team? We love to fight together as a team, but Nilius and Madness like to be better off working alone. Kinda like Superman or Batman. More team members equals easy bad guy beatdowns. Well, we may not get along, but we're always fighting strong together. Question 100. Drago, have you ever danced before? I have. I was dancing in Omen Alliance and Credits Japanese version. Question 101. Why the Bakugan fell asleep in the ball form? Because we need to sleep in the ball form so we can recover ourselves and get more energy. This question is from Infernite Ninja and he's got two questions. Question 102. Drago. What is your favorite WWE wrestler? Uh, none of them. I never watched it. Here is a question for me. Question 103. Fate Ninja, what song is stuck inside your head? Um, I'm guessing none? This question is from Nice Message from Above, and he's got three questions. Question 104. How are you guys doing in hibernation? We're doing good in hibernation, although it takes too long to recover ourselves. Hopefully, we will come back to the awesome brawlers and be with them in the Geogon Rising series. I hope so too, Cyrus, because it's not the same without you guys. And it's not the same without you too, Drago. And I'll be very happy to see the mirror to look at myself again. Is it because you'll be worried about your looks? No. Maybe. Question 105. How did you guys meet Leonidas? Well, it's kind of a long story. I used to be with a bad partner who doesn't appreciate other people and Bakugan. I refused to listen to my former partner for trying to destroy the stadium. So I decided to join the Awesome Brawlers and became Ajit's new partner. Question 106. By any chance, did one of you accidentally call Pensator a scorpion instead of a sand crab? No, none of us call him that. But what's the difference between a scorpion and a sand crab? I mean, he is a scorpion! No, he's not! He's not a scorpion! Pinsator is a sand crab, and don't mix them up! Well, what's the difference? This is a scorpion, and this one is a sand crab, like Pinsator. It's really easy to get confused because I can't even tell the difference. But it still makes him angry! And believe us, you don't want to see Pinsator get mad when you call him a scorpion. Yeah, he'll be blind with rage and go on a rampage when someone calls him that. After that, he doesn't remember what happened. Well, it's a good thing that Pinsator fell asleep so he won't able to hear you while you just called him. <laughs> <laughs> wow, 
Well, looks like Pensator is not the only one. Look! <sighs> of course. Treadorous fell asleep too. Let's leave those two alone so they can enjoy their naps and move on to the next question. Good idea, Bob Petra. Question 107. How old can a Bakugan be? Well, not very old, but we've been staying like this for a very long time in Vestroya. Question 108. For Drago and the gang, what's your thoughts about become a powerful ones? I think he meant the awesome ones. But we used to be called the awesome ones. After that, we renamed the awesome brawlers instead of the awesome ones. And besides, our partners became brawlers since they have us. That's why they renamed their team names. Question 109. To every Bakugan, are you only evil if your brawler is evil? What? No, none of us. Next. Question 110. When are you going to meet your legacy counterparts? I don't think that's going to happen, because Jerex prefers the rebooted Bakugan instead of original ones. Question 111. What's your favorite part of March? I don't think we have our favorite parts of March. But let's move on to the next question. And we have one last question to finish. Okay. And finally, question 112. Drago, did you know there's an alternative timeline with an old version of you and there were six elements, Pyrus, Aquas, Subterra, Haos, Ventus, and Darkus? You also fight against a large titan Bakugan called a Metagon. You also fight against a cyborg Bakugan called Helios. Well, I have three answers for you. Answer 1, I already know there's an alternative timeline with an old version of me. Answer 2, I know there's six factions. Pyrus, Aquas, Subterra, Haos, Ventus, and Darkus. As for Subterra, it didn't appear in Bakugan Rebooted series. So the Ventus faction became Earth. But it's not just about crystals or rocks or earthquakes. That includes nature and wind. It's just like planet Earth. And answer 3? No. I didn't fight a large titan Bakugan and I didn't fight against Helios. You're talking to the original Dragonoid instead of me. Well everyone, all those questions are finally finished. All right! Since all those questions are finished, what should we do now? How about we do the Bakugan battle? Yes, I've been waiting for this. Same here, I am ready for battle. Are you ready for battle to against me, Nilius? Yeah, You're on, Drago. Well, everyone, we're going to end this Bakugan Q&A video because we are ready for battle. I hope you enjoy this video. All right, it's time for... Bakugan Brawl! Bakugan Brawl, it's a big brawl. Bakugan Brawl, it's fucking all. Bakugan Brawl, standing tall with the awesome brawlers. Powers in her hands, sick of sand.